Good morning. My name is uh, Maurizio Sibilla. I am a senior research fellow at the School of the Build Environment at Oxford Brookes University. In the next few minutes, I'm going to introduce a, a piece of research developed by me in collaboration with my colleague, Dr. George Bloomberg. We did a framework of uh, the Construction Network Plus program, which is funded by the UK Research and Innovation through the Industrial Strategy Challenge Fund. As a, an introduction, I would like to share with you the following question. What characterize the future energy infrastructure? We sustained that the future energy infrastructure will be characterized by distributed, renewable and interactive energy system, called DRIST here, where the future generation of building will act as a main component of this network. However, this is a completely new form of infrastructure. Therefore, it is not sufficient to explore the technical aspect of this apparatus, but we need to explore the social technical implications and the capacity of the local stakeholders to put drives into practice. This is done by developing an appropriate technology support net. Technology support net is composed of different stakeholders with different scopes and objectives. They are called to work together in order to enhance the emergent socio-technical properties of this new system. This process involves both academics and non-academic stakeholders in writing the rules to achieve the vision of buildings as energy service at the local level. In order to understand this vision, as a first step, we have elaborated an innovative conceptual framework which provides a unitary framework concerning the concept of buildings as a component of a future energy infrastructure. The novelty of this framework is to clarify the relationship between the trajectory of innovation, new forms of management and tools, and the social technical implications related to drives which impact on industry and civil society. Our exploration has also involved a case study collection. These case studies belong to the Energy in Buildings and Community Program funded by International Energy Agency, represent the most advanced projects related to technological and social innovations. These projects show how to develop a niche of innovations at the local level to introduce new practices and to contest the resistance of the old regime. We have elaborated an association between the line of research pointed out by the conceptual framework and the case study analyzed, revealing that the technological innovation in terms of devices has received more attention with respect to the social innovation related to drives. This is one of the most important barriers to achieve a citizen-centered energy system and thus self-organized energy community. In order to contrast uh, this barrier, the information collected from uh, literature and case study has been used to develop a toolkit for knowledge integration and exchange. This toolkit can be used by academics and non-academic stakeholders to explore the concept of building as energy service, uh, point out what type of contribution can come from their expertise, but within a shared framework. This tool has been disseminated as open uh, educational resource. Instruction are now available at the Emerald Open Research Platform. Thank you very much for your attention.